Hey, so I just recently cleared up my garage with a whole bunch of boxes and stuff because we were moving more things. And something I realized when I didn't have too much room to train, I was still able to do a little bit, but not in my normal session stuff, was how important it was for me, and still is, to have a landmark when I'm practicing my strikes. And by landmark, I mean a fixed point, which is your target. Target, better word. And so, I, you know, I never thought about it before, but I always tended to do it where I would have a specific point in mind that I was aiming for when I was throwing a kick. And in this specific garage, it is this straight line right here, right? So if I'm throwing a kick, I'm trying to throw a kick along that line, no matter where I'm standing at. Even if I'm starting all the way back here, still trying to go along that. When I'm going this way, when I'm looking down here at that, it's that top point up there. That, you always, I'm always trying to be able to kick higher. You can always kick lower if you want to, but if you don't train to kick high, then you won't kick high. And so, reaching that as your target, when you're going up and down, like, all right, left leg, see, you didn't get it right, better, left, right, and that's kind of a way to go about it. That's a very important thing with striking, is knowing where you're going to hit, because when you're stopping and thinking about it, that's good. But when you're in the middle of it, and as I'm sure you've heard me say, my brain tends to shut down my higher cognitive abilities when I'm fighting. I just don't think about what I'm doing. My body still reacts and does what I want it to, and I can still hit the points where I'm trying to get to. So that's something to think about to add to your own training. If you're practicing drills going up and down the floor or anything like that, just something else to think about.